Hey everybody, it's Mark with G's Bees, and it is March the 7th, 2024, and I've just started pulling this box apart. I uh, just want you to see, this girl's already laying up, and I saw her, there she is right there. So I'm going to take and mark her from last year. So I know that she's an overwintered queen. Uh, but this this is hive has done very well. You can see she's already starting to, to, to take care of um, of business and start to let to lay. She got some cat brood in here, so this this box can be busting soon. You can see this stuff right here. This was a swarm uh, that I caught. So very gentle. It's about 62, 63 degrees today. She's peeping on the other side, so I'm gonna grab her cage her and keep on all right pretty successful i did not have the correct color uh to mark the queen so i did her yellow and uh wasn't able to get a video of that but what i did is i took the two honey supers consolidate them into one nine frame i just paint mine and put nine on it i also added a a, a inner cover with the vent like that i like to run them like that uh so this is one of the boxes i consolidated the best i could Took out some, some frames that uh, weren't drawn out or whatever. Um, but as you can see, stuff like this, I'm just gonna clean up. That one in there, you can just see, maybe you can see. There we go. It's just, it just needs to be trimmed down. And um, I'll, I'll clean this up. I'll go ahead and extract it. They did not eat much of the uh, emergency sugar. <laughs> Hot dog, got me already on the chin. All right, I'm doing this from a safe distance now. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna leave that part in there where I got zapped in the chin. Uh, yeah, there you go. First day out, first thing, so that way we can get that over and done with. That's what happens when you don't wear gear. Um, they were pretty upset. I flipped the boxes, um, so that way the second, the tallest deep has, uh, has comb in it. The queen was laying. They're bringing in pollen, but there's not a lot of reserves in it. Um, but uh, yeah, overall, it's a really good inspection on, on this little hive. Now I will graft from that queen. I've got a whole little setup. I think this year, 2024, I'm gonna do uh, follow the queen and see how she does series. At least that's kind of the plan. So I'm gonna let this box, that honey stuff sit there, let them calm down. Uh, it's, it's, I don't know, 12, 12.30 now, almost time for their orientation flight. So I'm just gonna leave them be, let them get settled, take them a, you know, a day or two. Uh, tonight when it cools down i'll come out here and grab that box uh clean up the frames uh extract what i can i think i was starting to say that i don't believe that there's a lot of table sugar in that um in that box right there um that was eaten by emergency feed they didn't they hardly touched it so i only put four pounds in there so there might have been three and a half um in there but there was a lot of honey but i just want to take the opportunity to clean up give them good good comb so the dead outs I had last year, it's great to have a comb. That way they'll be able to lay so, and, 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 and pull out honey. So kind of put a super on a little early, but uh, they're active. We'll see what happens.